Yemen's exile President Abdrabu Mansur Hadi has played down next week's talks in Geneva between his country's warring parties, saying they will only address ways to implement a Security Council resolution demanding his enemy's retreat. Hadi and his government's host, Saudi Arabia, have insisted that any talks center on Resolution 2216 which demands that the Iranian-backed Althus and forces loyal to former President Ali Abdullah select what cities they seized since last September and surrender heavy weapons. But with the Althus still entrenched across populated parts of western Yemen despite 11 weeks of Saudi-led airstrikes, international pressure has grown for Haiti to accept a compromise and negotiate with the Althus and Sela's representatives. These are not jokes, it is only a discussion to implement UN Security Council Resolution 2216, how to implement it on the ground, Haiti said in an interview with the Saudi-owned Al Arabiya television. He denied the United Nations-sponsored meeting due to start on June 14 was aimed at wide reconciliation or finding a political compromise to end the conflict. Haiti says 2216 adopted in April, had created a framework for peace by demanding that the Althus leave Yemeni cities they had seized since last year and allow his government to resume work from Sana'a. The Althus had rejected the resolution, however, saying Haiti's internationally recognized but exiled government has lost its legitimacy. Haiti also repeated accusations that Iran was systematically interfering in his country's affairs by backing the Althus. What Iran does at my country is more dangerous than al-Qaeda, Haiti said in the interview, parts of which were broadcast on Monday. Haiti fled Yemen and took refuge in Saudi Arabia in March after the Althus closed in on the southern city of Aden where he had fled after escaping house arrest imposed on him by the militia a month earlier. The president, who came to office in 2012 elections after Saleh was forced to step down by mass protests against his 33 years in office, has long accused Iran of meddling in Yemen's affairs. I had asked Iran, let your hand from Yemen, Haiti said. I did not bring this from vacuum. We caught people who had been trained by the Iranian Revolutionary Guard. They were jailed in our prisons, he added.